Nature is the basis of life, yet it is also a source of identity and diversity. Cultural heritage and creativity, including traditional indigenous practices, often draw from their natural surroundings and environmental resources. Having developed over time through mutual adaptation, biological and cultural diversity are intrinsically linked and together hold the key to sustainable development. In this spirit, the 72 World Heritage Convention was crafted almost half a century ago, linking the safeguarding of culture and nature under a shared instrument. The 1,154 sites that are inscribed on UNESCO's World Heritage List today express our common humanity, the richness of its cultures, and encompasses nature's most outstanding heritage. World Heritage Sites also embody the diversity of human-nature interactions. This invaluable heritage is, however, at the forefront of one of the most pressing challenges of our time, climate change and the loss of biodiversity. The loss of biological and cultural diversity jeopardizes nature and culture, including its contribution to sustainable development. Climate change is endangering our planet, economies, livelihoods, food security, and quality of life. The future of the next generation is at stake. This is recognized in the Fuzhou Declaration adopted by the World Heritage Committee at its extended 44th session hosted by China in July 2021, which called for a renewed approach to synergies between cultural and biodiversity-related conventions and reinforced international solidarity to preserve our shared cultural and natural heritage through fostering a new relationship of human beings with nature. UNESCO is hopeful that the 50 meeting of the Conference of the Parties of the Convention on Biological Diversity will adopt an ambition post-2020 global biodiversity framework. Such a framework will help define a clear pathway to halt biodiversity loss, reflecting the significant contribution of UNESCO World Heritage Convention to global biodiversity conservation. We are confident that through the collective effort of all biodiversity-related conventions, governments and civil society to safeguard the world biological and cultural diversity, we can ensure that the shared vision of living in harmony with nature is fulfilled. Thank you so much.